Hello everyone, God bless you, thank you for watching, Shalom. I hope you meet Jesus here. You know, I'm standing here at Alta Vista Chapel and I have a glory story to tell. A while ago, there was a prayer meeting here for someone who had a stroke. He's a well-known, uh, successful businessman here on the island. And they asked me to pray for him. He was in the hospital. He was unconscious. So I went there several times. I anointed him and prayed for him. But then they organized this uh, prayer meeting here at this chapel. And there were, uh, most of them were Hindi people. And also people came from abroad. A lot of friends and acquaintances uh, came from abroad from America and the Netherlands. And there were, there were uh, maybe about 60 people gathered here. And I also came here, but they put me on the spot because they asked me to, to lead the service. And you know, I always say that I'm born again ready for things, that the Holy Spirit will lead me. But I didn't prepare a sermon. But immediately I received 1 Kings 18 because I knew a lot of people there were praying in the name of their Hindi gods. But I was there uh, praying in the name of the God of Israel. And uh, so it reminded me of Elijah, you know, challenging the people, the worshippers, the Baal worshippers to call on the name of their gods. But then he called on the name of the God of Israel and fire came down from heaven. So I shared about Jesus Christ, I shared about this story and I really experienced fire coming down from heaven. Uh, people were touched by the Holy Spirit. I received words of knowledge and prophecies for people. The people came to the front to receive prayer for healing and deliverance even. And you know, I saw people being set free, being healed. And afterwards, people came to me and they told me that they were healed. I received prophecies for the family as well. And later I shared about Jesus Christ. And then congregation prayed to receive Him as Lord and Savior. Uh, so that's amazing. Of course, I don't know who sincerely prayed that prayer, who really had an encounter with Jesus, but still, the glory of Jesus Christ was manifested, manifested there. Uh, so that was an amazing thing that happened. Unfortunately, this uh, well-known entrepreneur, uh, he passed away. But I remember a few nights before he passed away, I prayed for him in the hospital. I anointed him with oil. And he, uh, he couldn't move his body, but he, he had his eyes open. And I asked him if he understood what I was praying. I, I asked him if he could wink his eyes. And he winked his eyes, so he understood what I was praying. And then later I told him about Jesus, and I asked him if he wanted to receive Jesus as his Messiah. And he also winked his eyes then. So my hope for him is for the best, that he's home with the Lord right now. And so that was a beautiful thing that happened as well. So this is the glory story I wanted to tell, all glory to King Jesus. So amazing to see His glory manifested here in public at this beautiful chapel here, Alto Vista. It's a very old chapel. That's what I wanted to share with you. Please like, subscribe and share so to make this channel grow. But thank you for watching. May the grace of our Master Jesus Christ, the extravagant love of our Father and the intimate friendship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Love and shalom and see you next time. Bye bye.